Lauren is practicing hard at the Blakey School of Irish Dance for a significant event. Janice Blakey is fine-tuning the youngsters in preparation for the Western Canadian Oroctus. She's been working us really hard uh, preparing uh, our steps um, and our endurance and our technique a lot. I'm practicing and I'm going to do my best and forget the rest and try and listen to the music. It's just really fun to me. The whole world and everybody I've met are just, they're just awesome people and so supportive and it's just a really cool world and a really cool sport to be part of. Notice she called it a sport and it truly is. There's a lot of training outside the dance floor and they have to have strong core strength to perform like this. We don't use our arms, so we need to leap really high in the air. We only use our core, our quads, our calves. So our core and our legs are, you know, um, quite strong. They sweat, blood, sweat and tears. And so although it is dancing and they do try to be graceful and all the, you know, technique for dance, they also have to have a really big sport aspect in their physique. Dante is in his third year with this school, but has never been to a competition like this, while Lauren has been here before. It's a really big competition for me, especially because I've been to the Worlds twice now and I really would like to go back. I'm positive that I'll either get fourth or third. The youngest kids, the under eights, they don't go to Worlds because um, it's 10 years and up for Worlds, but the younger ones are trying to qualify for North American Championships and it's in Orlando this year. so. Of course they know where Disney World is, so they're all working hard for that. So it's cute because, you know, we try to keep it fun for the little ones. It's the hardest competition of the year. So basically how they perform at this competition reflects what they'll be doing for the rest of the year, whether they'll be going to Worlds in um, March or Nationals in July. So they need to qualify now for all those events. So they are working hard. It's a pretty big coup for Kelowna to host this event. Over 1,000 dancers and family will descend on the city. If you like river dance, Lord of the Dance, Irish dance, it is going to be an amazing thing to come see. It's not a show, it's a competition, but it's the highest level of Irish dance in all of Western Canada, all in one place. So it's a really neat thing to see if you're around downtown Kelowna.